Hello. Good evening. As you can see, today I'm having Easter's. We are privileged in our studio to have guests, and this shows that we have made one step ahead. I want to give them one minute each for introduction. So I'm starting from my left hand side. We have Mr. Victor Karibun Sana. Thank you. Uh, my name is Victor Mumo Munyaka. Um, it's a pleasure to be in this place actually. And uh, first, I thank Mr. Nyambane. Uh, how I learned this channel of Mr. Nyambane is through my friend in school, who back then was not used to perform well in mathematics. But now, I, it happened that he was all, all every, every day actually making it. And I went and requested him to tell me the secret. And he told me, go in the YouTube and look at the Mr. Nyabane channel. And that is how I've learned Mr. Nyabane channel. Thank you, Mwani. Karibu sana. Uh, you said you come from? Ukambani. Hey, that's a very nice place. Even though there's no water. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I was there for, for six years. Really? But the people from there are very nice. That's good. You know this university known as Seiko? I know it really. Yeah, much it is you it in Tengeneza. That's why I'm here now having a YouTube channel. I told you should <laughs> cool. Sana, thank you. Uh, yeah, I have a colleague by the name uh, Makli. Uh, it is your time. Uh, yes, uh, my name is Makilini Uchuka. I'm a student at the Wolfini. Uh, I learn about my Mr. Nambane channel uh, through my friend Kipin, like uh, my colleague has said. This is due to interaction with my friend. So I wanted to, I wanted to find out how this man can well, maximize his score day by day. But then he introduced me the same thing to me. Thank you. You said you come from? Ah, uh, yes, I come from Kakamega. Wow. Uh, how, what can you say to the Kakamega colleagues? Yes. Uh, I love you all, please subscribe the channel and find more about the channel. Ah, thank you. You need to tell the Ukambani people <laughs> to go on YouTube and search my Nyamane. Oh, um, subscribe. I'm sorry. I'm sorry <laughs> for that. I want to add the people from Ukambani, the pride minds there. You go to the Mr. Nyamane channel, just write to my Nyamane, the channel will appear. And you look at the content, it's very important, and you subscribe, I will appreciate. Thank you so much. On my other side, I have uh, Mr. Moses. Are you the Moses in the Bible? <laughs> no, Mr. Just call me Moses. Okay. Moses Kiyosa Zete. I'm a, a composed student, laborate. Pleased to be in the presence of Mr. Nyambane at this company right now. And now, how, how did I come to know Mr. Nyambane? On my daily routine of, you know, going through YouTube searching for the best revision material for my So I come across this name, Mwalimu Nyambane, and I tap him. My friend, let me tell you, these are the best. It's, he has the best. I can attest to that the best for it. That is why I ask you, take your phone right now, subscribe to this channel, and get to enjoy what we are enjoying out here, my friend. What are you waiting for? Are you? Huh? Thank you so much. Yeah, now today uh, I want them to talk about paper one because people fear math so much. I got someone commenting and saying, Congratulations, because you have made this math to look simpler. And I'm going to make it more simpler for you because I want you to have it and you perform well in your academics. It is my pleasure if you do that. Kindly subscribe, as they have said, because you are going to enjoy much. More is coming. So far, we have 28 videos uh, where we upload almost each day. Don't miss. I want to give you uh, a chance to talk about paper one and the general how a week students can perform well in math. Yeah, thank you, Mwadiu Nyambane. I want to talk about paper one. It's a very uh, easy paper and uh, you just need to 
have that we call time. Time is very essential in everything you do and in mathematics it takes time. And I want to talk about section one. Section one which has 16 questions. Make sure every question you take at least a maximum of five minutes. I go to section two. Section two has eight questions and in those eight questions I'm urging you, you use each question at least, the five questions which you have selected, use not more than 10 minutes. Thank you. And I want to tell you that when you use that method of time management, I assure you, you'll make it in the mathematics paper one and it will be just seem easy to you. Thank you. Hey, it seems that you like maths nowadays. I like mathematics nowadays because I, I <laughs> never liked mathematics actually. I was telling that. Uh -huh. Yeah, but now, since you have shown us or now to be managing time, I've been in position because I found myself having a, a lot of time to review my work very well. Okay. Yeah, that's. Thank you. Mr. Machuka. Yes, Master. Machuka. Ama ni Machuka. Machuka. Oh, good, good. Yeah. What can you tell our viewers? Uh, the viewers, we love you very much, and one thing I have to ask, I, I must tell you, if I won't tell you, I say, the video to me, it's useless for now. One thing is that we have to maximize this course. It's a mission of every student to go in class with being sure that I must get something. I must score this. A mission is, with a tricky, go get the paper. If you don't, the anxiety you have it, you can do it in twice, write, hold them, read out. One thing is, go through your paper, read and extract the important numerical values, find the accurate volume, the formula for it for each, then start what you are Another thing is that, make sure, section two, so far you can take, take the test, less, not more than 20 minutes, finding the question that you are sure of, you can get the maximum score compared to the other. Those are, make sure you mark before you start, because when it comes to all the rest of section one, you may find it that if you were not marked, you find a challenge deciding whether to do this or do the other one. I urge you to be to do your work, do your work very well, and that I assure you will appreciate very much. Yeah, thank you. Uh, you love maths too? Yes, I am not a here. <laughs> What's your best subjects in school? Uh, it's math, physics, biology. Yeah. You know, we love every subject. Oh, you want to become an engineer or a doctor? Exactly. Wow. <laughs> don't, become a uh, don't become a teacher. Yeah, yeah. Because uh, I, I don't want uh, you to compete with me. <laughs> become uh, somebody important than Mr. Nyama. But the generations are coming and are coming and are coming. We need more. Yeah. Need more. <laughs> okay. So you want to become a teacher? I didn't mean that. But if I teach you, why should I need to? Okay. It's nice to hear that. So, Mr. Moses, what can you tell our viewers? Um, basically, as my friends have been, have been telling you, paper one, what is paper one? Just to quickly pinpoint on the basic thing that you need to know. I, I would rather tell you that paper one is basically form one and form two up. You, you just have to up your form one and form two up. But there are a few topics we, we, we talk about how to form one and form two. These topics are like calculus. Calculus is a concept, and a calculus there is this concept called differentiation. Yeah. Differentiation is a concept you cannot not and quickly comprehend if you are a, a good student. Just sit down. You, the head of teachers, such teachers as Mr. Nyamane, that is why we have this channel, by the way. Calculus. Another topic we have is uh, um, bearing and uh, construction. Bearing and construction is basically a 10 mark question which you, you should easily get. And for you, my for you viewers out there, I would rather tell you, for you just pass the step one, up your form one and form two work, I'll tell you you'll be having more than 85% of your work if you do what I'm telling you. And up what my fellow students have been telling you, I'd rather tell you that mathematics is about constant practice. Practice, practice, practice makes perfect. Thank you. Thank you so much.
uh, before I give you uh, some seconds to add one or two things, uh, do you know that in section A, someone can, uh, can do a question twice? So you demarcate the space you are given. And then you, if you are not sure of the answer, but you have one answer, you, you do the first one here and the second one there. You don't close any. The examiner will just mark the correct one and then leave the wrong one. So that's also another, another point that we should take as, as, as students. This is very, very important. If you find yourself having two answers, not knowing which, which one is correct, do or if you are working without country and then demarcate the two uh, workings so that the examiner can choose the one to mark and again in section a just do the questions you know fast for example according to mr victor he told you that we are having 16 questions if you are having six questions that's that's, that's 18 marks because most of the questions are 3-3 three, three marks. Then go to section 2. Pick uh, like 3 questions that you know. In each question you get 3, 3, I mean 5, 5, 5. That's 15. 15 plus 18 is 33. That's a, a D plus. Sometimes it's a, a C minus. You have made it. So don't fear marks. Make sure that when you go to an exam room, you have the confidence because you have done these kind of questions before. This is not the first time you are facing a math uh, examinations. Remember, the difference uh, between the other exams and the one that you are expecting in March, is the difference is the, the name. The one that you have been doing is bearing the name of your school. Now the one that you will do in March is bearing uh, neck. So that's what people fear, that I'm now doing a main exam. No, don't fear, it's the normal exam that you, you have been doing. You will find uh, the questions that you have been doing here in class are the ones which are there. So what you need is manage your time the way they have said. Make sure that you extract mathematical values from each question more, more so when you are dealing with word questions. Because they have some of the questions which are direct, evaluate, simplify, okay? So make sure that you extract those values from word uh, problems so that you can be able to think of the formula to use and get the answer that is required. Start from the simple questions, they will give you more art. Even if you find only 6 out of 16, do them, go to section B, try the ones that you can. That's how you can easily make it. I'm going to say, 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 I'm and I'm not satisfied you to do that with your other students because they may end up having a difference. Please, that is just for you. Math is the cheapest and easiest subject you can approach. You can't approach the Spanish. I'm looking forward to bringing more guests for you so that you can hear from them. So today I'm the happiest man to have visitors. You have made my day. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Uh, there's something I've remembered, by the way. Most of my viewers, are not students by now, they are parents. What can you tell the parents? Uh, I have much to say about the, to the parents, about uh, in doing this uh, mathematics. Uh, give your, uh, your children the chance to visit the YouTube because they might use it in a good way, like how I use, I use this in a good way. I need to give you a challenge. I'm a student and I used to score uh, 10, which is a number also, but now with the YouTube channel, <laughs> I've been able to go to 25. Good. Yeah. That is what the challenge I can give to the parents. One second. What can you tell the parents? Because they are the ones having the smartphones, they are the ones who are feeling. Take this chance. Do you all parents out there take this chance? You know, there's no student in mathematics. So if you are a parent and you have a student, that does not say you. Even if you don't have a student, this is your chance. There is no student for mathematics. So if you are just taking the chance to learn mathematics, congrats to you. But if you still have a student up there, welcome him to the channel. Thank you. One second. What can you tell uh, 
viewers who are parents. Yes, the viewers who are parents. So I thank you very much because if if you just can just spend even you know, fifty bob could just change the mind of your child from the attitude that he has. It's very simple because fifty bob can't go to that guy, that that child at home may give you many much much rewards that that fifty bob. Please just give them the chance. Thank you so much. We will do more things for you so that your children back home can love maths and improve on it because maths is everywhere. Even in our day lives, you send your children back to the market, go oh, buy this for me, you bring the balance, that maths. So make them change the attitude first. I'm going to have uh, visitors next weekend, don't miss. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you watch and share. When you go back home, 